What is up, YouTube? It is your boy, the one with the scar on his face, your boy Scarface. And today we're doing a reaction video to, uh, I mean, this guy just sent me a message uh, about Osuna. And I didn't know this was happening. I guess he was actually being extorted. And so he's actually going to court for things like that, of that nature, and what I thought about it. Okay, so basically what's happening, there's a guy named Kevin Fret who is actually exploiting Osuna, uh, demanding money for a video that he had. I don't know if he showed it to Osuna or what was on the video. Some people, I was research, doing some research right before, right before I did this because I was actually doing homework. I don't know if you guys can see like my paperwork and stuff. So don't think I wasn't doing anything. I was doing my homework, but I thought I'd bust out this video real quick. But so I guess he was... Uh, it was some sort of video, maybe some sort of porno or something homophobic. They're not exactly saying what it was, but it was something like a sexual type of video. And it was back when he was 16. So it was something he did back when he was 16. And uh, he, right now he's 26, so that was like 10 years ago. You can't judge him. I mean, we've all done stuff that we, we wish we never had done. Or if someone somebody would shed light to something that we didn't do, or that we did before, we'd be, you know... We've grown into bigger people, you know what I mean? Like, we're not the same people that, um, we're not the same people that we used to be when we were younger. He was 16, he was a kid. Um, if it was like something homophobic, you never know, like, he was questioning his sexuality. You, you don't know, or like, if it was some sort of sexual video or a porno or something like that, you know, being curious, being, you know, and doing things like that. I'd understand if it was something like, uh, if he was like some sort of pedophile or, things along those lines but he was 16 like he, he was still underage it makes sense a lot like when he went to cali bash he did a whole like uh speech saying that you can't you know don't judge him for his past but you know j judge somebody by who they are right now which is true he's probably a whole different person especially like growing up i mean 10 that was 10 years ago he grew up i'm pretty sure we're not the same, you're not the same person you were 10 years ago neither am i i'm nowhere near close to who i was 10 years ago we probably, you know, some people had did, done something stupid back then, and now if it would come back up, you'd probably regret it or not want people to know about it because you were just immature at that time or, you know, whatever your case is. So at the end of the day, you can't judge Osuna unless he keeps, like, unless it was something, like, bad, you know, like, you know, it just depends on what was on the video. But if it was, like, he was just being sexual with some other girl or even if it was a guy, it doesn't matter, like, if that's what he wanted to... If that was his choice, then, you know, if he was curious, then that's, that's up to him. Like, yeah, I know he's, like, a superstar. Kids look up to him now. That's why I said, like, if he didn't grow from it, then it would be a problem. But he's a whole different person now. He shouldn't have cut the dreads off. I'm just saying that because I think he looked good with the dreads. But that's just me. That's my opinion. You can't judge him for his past. Just give him a chance now. Uh, he's a whole different person. He's a superstar. You know, every little thing he does now is be amplified tenfold. Also, what happened on that is that that guy died. Uh, I guess he got killed uh, January 10th or something like that. And that same guy that was extorting him, that's why Osuna's going to uh, court right now or working with the, the police. That way, because some people are saying that he had something to do with it because he was extorting him. I guess Osuna had originally paid him 50000 to not release the video. I don't think it got released or who knows. I haven't seen it. But if it does, then we'll see what he's trying to hide. If it was just like, if he was being curious with the guy then let me know what you guys think about this case do you think it's bad if it was something homophobic or like you can't judge the man especially when he was only 16 and he was still growing you know he was still a teenager so let me know what you guys think and i'll see you guys later